All right, guys, uh, it is a second inverter. So you a second uh, 48 volt inverter right here at the JW Solar USA. We're gonna be testing this and we're gonna show you exactly how everything goes with the second inverter. You've seen the first inverter. We on, we open it up when we test it, put power into it and we get it into the mate and see exactly what it is. Take care, stay tuned, like and subscribe. Gonna be having all the wires connected. So we're gonna get the mates connected here. All right, the mate is in. We're gonna be testing the voltage as well. The AC out and we're gonna be testing the voltage input and we see how everything works this is a seal the one that we use is the odd back is the vented one okay that was a vented so the one we just dealt with is a vfxr so anyone when you start with the v is a vented one the vfxr 3048e that's the one we just dealt with, we already tested, and now we're gonna be testing this other one, and I'm gonna be talking to you more about this. This is the seal version, no fan, it's seal. Just like the one I have right there on my board, that's a seal one as well. So this has to use a turbo fan, and uh, turbo fan supposed to be on the uh, seal version, because the seal version it has only little fans inside the inverter. It doesn't have a, 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 a fan like the vented one that has like a big hole here. You've seen that. Watch the video again. It's a big fan right there that cools extract. And on the side, it has a fins right here, like a little mesh, both ends to uh, take in that's a, the inputs. It takes the air out and the exhaust is taking it out of from here. It sucks it in on both sides and vent it out. Okay, so that's the extractor fan. So this one is just a sealed one that you guys can see. It's going to just blow the air on this one and cool the entire cast metal. and makes this thing really cooler. And the fan right there, you can see a little light right here. It's going to be an amber light. It's orange right here. So wires has to connect here. I have the cover. Attach it to the aux, the positive and negative here. And that's how he's going to power the uh, inverter, uh, sorry, the fan to cool this at a certain temperature when this one really gets so hot. And it turns on and cool the system. So let's go back and do the connection right here. It's a 48 volt. Hold on for this. And guys, uh, we can go right on this and check it out. I got my breaker right there. I'm going to be installing um, these guys here. My terminals. All right, I hope you like the videos and um, we're going to be having more to come as we continue with our install and test and whatever. And you guys will just love the power of the Outback. So it's a very, very, very good inverters. And um, trust me, if you have the opportunity to get one, I will say buy it. Okay, you will never regret it. There are a lot of inverters out there which are really good some inverters you pay in the price but nothing die hard machine right here outback so outback if you can if you hear my or happen to watch or come across my video and uh, this is your product product sorry i just want to be proud of you guys for all the good work and um, all this ingenuity you are putting here uh, you have a, um, a customer who is really pleased with your we so really satisfy and pleased with your ingenuity and with your product. So if you have anything in the future you want me to talk about or back and you can contact me on JWSolarUSA at hotmail.com J-W-S-O-L-A-R-U-S-A at hotmail.com So we can go from there. I know you already um, had my 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 channel added to your your profile there which i really appreciate outback and guys with all you guys help you know we already into the outback um 
profile. Check it out there. You see JW Solar USA and um, in uh, with uh, Outback. Outback already add me into their profile. So it has been there for a while. I never just mentioned it, but I really appreciate that that happened. And um, when it supports uh, products and uh, they tend to recognize you, hey, it's a good sign. So what I'm going to do right now, you see, I'm going to be uh, setting up um, the, uh, the output here so that you guys can able to see how the... Um, What's the voltage gonna read? This we always check on the output right there. It's the output. So we're gonna take our probes and stick it right in there and stick the neutral out. Okay, that's just simple for me. You can do anyhow you want to do it, but this is the way I'm doing it. And um it's working for me. Trying to eliminate uh I don't have too much a lot of hands. You know or fingers to hold so now it's not going anywhere so we get it set up and we got a meter it's gonna be up here set it up here and we're gonna power up this uh, device 48 volts and see how everything works live here at the command center of the JW solar USA live in Minnesota and let's check it out so on the breaker right here kiss fingers across Right there, power on. Here goes the mate. Say FXR inverter. See the lights is there, the orange lights stays on. If the turbo fan would have connected, that that's the second initial start. So it's synchronizing it, and this light's gonna go, the little fans that inside's gonna stop. Okay, yeah, you go. The light went off, so that's the initial start, initializing everything. So let's check again and see how everything works right here um, at the JW Solar USA. And guys, everything's just. Let's check the voltage on the device. Okay, we're gonna put it on AC mode. Turn this off and okay this reads uh 233 234 volt the other one was reading almost 240 volt that's the uh that would be the um the vfxr 3048 was reading 240 to something so this one is reading here okay there we go 234 volt AC okay all right that output and stay tuned log into the password again 141 it's a password hit enter we are in okay so we get in here system we're gonna go uh, into system serial number that's a serial number right there guys this is uh fxr 23 48e FXR 2348E. So it tells you the model of the inver in the, of the inverter. Okay, that's what I did. And well, guys, this just gives you a proper understanding how you can find out about inverter, even if the sticker is not there, and you can able to go about it and find it. If you have the mate, he's gonna tell you everything. Live here at the JW Solar USA, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, so all, as always, stay tuned, and uh, subscribe, and be an active subscriber or viewer, and comment to my videos, get your, subscribe and turn the notification bell on for further videos coming on your way. 
live here at JW Solo USA in Minnesota. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Love you guys all. Subscribe.